Welcome back to Bioscholar. In this video, we'll delve into the similarities and differences between plant and animal cells, two fundamental building blocks of life. Let's begin with the similarities that both plant and animal cells share. Both plant and animal cells have a plasma membrane, a protective barrier controlling what enters and exits the cell. Both of these cells are classified as eukaryotic. At their core, each cell features a nucleus that is protected by a nuclear envelope, housing the cell's genetic material. Both cell types contain membrane-bound organelles such as the endoplasmic reticulum, mitochondria, Golgi apparatus, and vacuoles. For detailed insights into these organelles' structures and functions, please click the I button to access the recommended video. It offers comprehensive information and is a valuable resource. Now, let's get back to our topic. Let's explore the differences that set plant and animal cells apart. Plant cells are encased in a rigid cell wall made of cellulose, providing structure and protection. Animal cells, on the other hand, lack this wall and rely on a flexible plasma membrane. In terms of shape and size, plant cells tend to be rectangular and larger, while animal cells are round or irregular and generally smaller. One of the most significant distinctions is the presence of chloroplasts in plant cells, responsible for photosynthesis. Animal cells lack these green powerhouses. Animal cells are equipped with more lysosomes, crucial for cellular waste disposal, while plant cells typically have fewer or none. Centrioles, vital for cell division, are found in animal cells, but are absent in plant cells. Plant cells connect through plasmodesmata, enabling substance exchange, whereas animal cells use gap junctions for direct communication. Finally, Energy storage differs. Plant cells store energy as starch, while animal cells store it as glycogen. In summary, while plant and animal cells share a common eukaryotic foundation, they've evolved unique adaptations to suit their specific roles in the diverse world of life. Understanding these differences and similarities sheds light on the remarkable complexity of cellular biology. Thank you for joining us on this journey into the intricate world of plant and animal cells. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon for more videos about science and biology.